My father told me, sing to the spirits and the people will follow. What's up, my name is Kaid. I'm an artist that's very into neo soul, hip hop, R&B, and I'm based here in Melbourne. When I was in high school, my father introduced me to this program. I had no idea what it was. He was just like, you like to sing, so this will be a good spot. So I went in and soon realised it was a hip-hop mentoring program called Dig Deep, and it was run through Art Centre Melbourne at the Channel. One person that I'd really appreciate and helped me was Ms. Risk, who is a DJ based here in Melbourne. And she'd be putting on a weekly program for people to just get up and do their thing at Ferdy Dirk called Gallery. From there, I was just like, I really want to do this and I want to take it seriously and I want to take myself seriously. I think the music industry in Melbourne is heavily supported. My mentor, Momo, he was just like, I've been waiting for you to say this. I didn't want to push you, I just wanted you to come up with this organically. So <laughs> I linked up with him and we've been creating ever since. <laughs> I love going into spaces that I can just sing to trees and insects and I hope they don't hate my music too much. <laughs> my creating process could come from anything, whether it's a melody just pops into my head or someone says something and it resonates with me. The first time that it really hit me that I'm like out here singing, and I've, I'm doing this as my job, <laughs> was when I did my single launch at the Gasometer. My, my feelings when coming and performing my first show here at the Gasa was absolutely wild. I, I don't even feel like I was like scared or nervous or anything. I was just ready to get out there and give thanks to everyone that came through. The way that the Melbourne Museum looks, I think it's pretty iconic. I've gone in there for a performance they put on called Nocturnal. So I think it's cool that they're putting the museum and what they're usually about, but putting music and creators involved with it as well. I've been touring around Australia for, for shows and I'm gonna tell you that Melbourne is, is the place for the music scene. If you love music, I would definitely recommend Section 8. I love the vibe in there, and they've got DJs who DJ with vinyl, so some proper DJs, and they got some a very eclectic mix of sounds that they're playing from reggae to hip hop to old R&B, all kinds of vibes. It's just got everything you need. <laughs> Melbourne is just so amazing and the opportunities, especially for the young'uns coming up as well. There's always spaces for them to be able to express themselves how they want to. It's just been all love and if one of us is rising up, we all love. What makes it home for me is the people in it and their drive and their want to just create and to express themselves. Just the support and the people that have helped me and given me opportunities and, you know, saw something in me. I really could not ask for more. <laughs> <laughs>